Hi, this is a video for Daf Lamed Bet. Uh, I thought it'd be interesting to talk a little bit of a broader perspective uh, concerning the Arba Minim. Uh, we all know what we use today for our Arba Minim. I'm just opening a little Tanakh here to Vayikra Kaf Gimel Pasuk uh, Mem, I believe it is. Let us just see if we get there. Nachon, Wakachtem Lachem Bayom Rishon. Pre eight sadar kapot marim vanaf eight savot varve nachel. So you shall take for yourself on the first day the product of the hadar trees, branches of palm trees, bows of leafy trees, and willows of the brook. And if you listen to the translation, this is from the JPS, you can hear here that uh, what we know to be the arba minim, the four species that we use for the lulav, the etrog, the lulav, the palm, the willow, and the um, myrtle are not at all identified in the verses. Um, the lulav uh, is mentioned there in the sense of a palm, but it says kapot tmarim, which really could be the branches that have the dates on them. Uh, the uh, product of the hadar tree, as JPS says, um, we're not, meaning of Hebrew uncertain, and traditionally the product is identified as a citron or as an etrog. But we really don't know exactly what the pshat, the simple meaning of the pasuk is. The willows, that is the only um, species that's identified by name, the arava, and the uh, hadas, the branch of a leafy tree, is not mentioned there a name at all. So we can see here that um, our traditions don't come just from a simple pshat, obvious interpretation from the Pasuk, but really from the tradition. The, uh, the Lulav is really something that we can see is probably a very, very ancient tradition. Doesn't come necessarily directly from the verse, but Jews for a very, very long time, certainly from the Second Temple period and onward, have interpreted the verse to mean as we understand it today. And that's part of why you see this battle throughout the um, these Dapim trying to say, how do we know that this is what the verse is talking about? The rabbis are trying to match their tradition with what it says in the verse. And sometimes it's an easy thing to do, and sometimes it's a bit more challenging.